store and spray paint of your choice. We primed ours with a base coat of white and then painted it silver. After you finish spray painting, let it dry and print out a marble picture on some paper and then measure it to fit the size of your tray. Next, you need to take some double-sided tape, or here we have a glue runner, and just tape down the back of it so that it will be secure on the tray. Next, take some Mod Podge and place it on top of the paper to seal it and prevent any ripping or tearing of your marble paper. Finally, we took some acrylic paint and painted the edges of our tray just to give it a little pop of color. This is the second marble tray we decided to make. The only difference for this DIY is that we just picked up a different tray and printed out a different marble pattern. So you will repeat the same steps of measuring the bottom of the tray so that your paper will fit exactly to the bottom, taping it to secure it, and mod podging it to seal it. glasses from Dollar Tree that were different shapes and sizes along with uh, another tray and spray painted them all silver. So come on, give me a taste. Oh, this is what it should look like once you've spray painted. It took us about two coats of spray paint. Next, we hot glued the bottoms of the glasses to the tray so they would stay in place. Oh, all of the dads and the others keep making love to each other And I'm trying, 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 trying All of the dads and the others keep making love to each other And I'm trying, I'm trying, trying, but I can't keep my hands to myself Thanks so much for watching our video.
part two of our DIY desk decor will be up next week. Bye! Bye.